Hi guys. I woke up this morning. It was kind of dark, cloudy. My house seemed kind of dark and I, did, I just didn't feel like staying in today. So I decided I would go to DeWitt, Arkansas and go into a few secondhand stores. They have two flea markets and then there's a place down on the square that the lady sells uh, jewelry, secondhand jewelry. So those are the places I'm going to visit today. Uh, I might try to film inside. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. And if I find anything, I'll let you know. When I walked in the store, I noticed that the two owners were breaking down the wall. I laughed and said, y'all are really having a grand opening, aren't you? Uh, we are making an opening for our customers to come back and forth between both of our buildings. We just expanded, and so uh, we're trying to make it more convenient for our customers. And your name of your store? It's Apple Blossom Boutique and More in DeWitt. Okay, uh, this is their grand opening. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, this Saturday we are having a celebration of opening our second building. Um, we are inviting vendors to come up and rent spots out in our parking lot. Uh, it's $5 for a single spot and $10 for a double spot. Um, you just pay when you set up and you can leave whenever you want. Um, but we want to have a big celebration and invite everybody out. Okay, thanks. I bought this bottle today for only a dollar. This is where I'm displaying it. I'm going to add some water and a plant cutting. These are some naughty frogs. I won't show you the underneath part. <laughs> Look at this. Isn't this just as cute as it can be? $3 for this little fish. I think I'm going to get it. I noticed in this first mall that a lot of the vendors were getting ready for the Christmas season. It's very festive. I noticed that this mirror was about $15. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who 
who loves junking most of all? Mirror, mirror on the wall, who loves junking most of all? Me! Now I'm out looking, I love to look at jewelry to see if maybe there's a hidden treasure somewhere among all the glitter. When you're out looking, you have to scour every nook and cranny because you never know what you might find. Like an owl that cost only a dollar or a tea set that costs four. Hmm, so cool. Okay, I'm sitting in front of this other flea market in DeWitt. I'm about to go inside. We'll see what we can find there. I'm really interested in this. I have some old slides from my grandmother. Hmm, let me think about this. Check out this love seat. It's kind of cool. And they want $30 for it. This little guy's hair looks about like mine. Oh, me. Pretty frame. They only want seven dollars for it. Sometimes I find neat things in this one, this booth. I don't know if I'm seeing anything today. Nope. store down on the city square and I was looking for some jewelry there. Didn't have any luck. Well I'm not having any luck here either. Maybe next time. This looks sort of old. I found this cart. It would make a perfect thing for your art room to put your paint on. It was only $15. I passed. I have too many carts already. Today I found four items. I spent a total of about $7.75, I think it was. I bought, let me see, a hand an incense hand and I'll show you the others a little bit later see what when I get home okay I bought the fish and I'm going to place it in my kitchen window it's by an artist named Diane I love it isn't it cute and then I bought this bottle that I'm going to use to sprout some plants. And the hand. I love the hand. I'm a collector of hands. I put it with my head that has succulents in it, artificial succulents. My last purchase were the naughty frogs. After I die and someone has my estate sale, I can just hear the people say, what was that old woman thinking? The sun came out today. Yay! Even when the sun isn't shining, 
junking can always brighten my day. I hope you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Enjoy more. Bye.